strawberries. You have the perfect life. And an angel's the rich, handsome husband who adores you. My summer one Dear Mr. O'Hare, is really made there is never enough time. Never enough of you. Dear Mrs. Sterling, know that you hold my hopes, my heart in your hands. Features? It's, it's Rory from Archive. I think I found something you want to come and take a look at. Uh, is that gum? Mm-hmm. Yeah, we don't we don't allow gum in the mm-hmm. reading rooms. Swallowed it. Great. Look at this. What is it? It's a letter. While I was researching for my next feature, I came across some illicit love affair, postmarked 1965. Dear Mr. O'Hare, you demolished a wall around me I hadn't know existed. What do you think you'll do with it? Burn it. No, I'm kidding. Probably just make sure it gets properly catalogued. John, what about trying to track down whoever sent it? What if we ran away together? Do you have any idea what you're asking of me? I'm afraid to love you. I'm afraid that if I let myself go, I would love you so much it would consume me. I have to know if there are more of these. If you think that this is even close to anything that I've ever felt, then you couldn't be more wrong. I think I found one. Oh my god. I'll be on platform two on Friday at 7.15 p.m. Come with me, darling. Spare him a life half-lived, a marriage of convenience. If you try to leave, I will destroy you. These letters, they're so rich in feeling. Now I'm gonna have to know how it ends. The thing is, if you're going to elope now, you probably just send a text. Hey, babes, meet me at the station if you're interested. Hashtag come with if you want to change your life forever. Smiley face, aubergine, road sign, sausage. Mm-hmm.